Honestly, wasn't sure about this in the beginning because I feel like I wore a skirt when I was like in fifth grade. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. I am Ashley Janelle and if you can't already tell from the title of the video, we are doing another one of my classic hauls. I'm so excited. If you have been following me for a while or subscribed to me for a while, you know that hauls are one of my favorite videos to put together. Um, I know that y'all also really enjoy watching them, but I'm not going to lie to y'all. I don't just like purchase things just to do a haul. Um, I do hauls as I shop. So yes, that's why you guys haven't gotten a haul in a while, but we are back with another Zara haul. Um, this is going to be from Zara's, some of their new pieces that they're starting to put out for the spring and the summer. Um, really, really, some really, really nice pieces um, and a lot of just pieces in general that I'm going to give my honest opinion about. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get right into it. But before we do, please make sure that you are subscribed if you have not subscribed already. Um, I don't want you to miss out on any of the amazing content that we have coming up. So yes, go ahead and subscribe and let's go ahead and get into the clothes. All right, so let's go ahead and get into the very first item. So the first item is going to be actually the shirt that I have on right now, which is kind of like this, it's it's like a pinkish, wait, no, it's not pink. It's like a creamish color. Um, it's kind of like a cropped um, sleeveless, kind of turtleneck situation. I really, really like this. Um, if you are um, familiar with Aritzia and a lot of the different fabrics that they have for their tops, um, this is gonna be pretty similar. This is one of the reasons why I was kind of drawn to it because I really like the fabric and the quality. Um, but yes, I love this shirt. I think that this is great. This is just like a great basics piece. My only kind of qualm with the top is gonna just be kind of like this neckline here with the, um, you know, the turtleneck situation. Um, I definitely, so I'm wearing a small um, and I'm typically like a small medium in tops, but I grabbed a small because I thought, you know, this would work for me. And honestly, it is my size. I would just say the turtleneck, it's not tight, but like this material of the shirt in general is very like, I don't know how to explain it. Like it's a, it's kind of like a compression material. So you, you do feel that a little here. It's not like super tight. Like honestly, I didn't really think about it until I started talking about it, but just something to, to you know, think about or be knowledgeable about. Um, I think this shirt was somewhere around like $44. Don't get me um, wrong. I will have everything linked so that you can go and purchase it or you know check it out for more details. But yeah, absolutely love this shirt. I really like how versatile it is and that it's a good statement piece to be able to mix and match with other, um, not necessarily a statement piece, but it's a good basic to be able to mix and match with other items in your closet. You can do it with a skirt, you can do it with jeans, you can do it with, you know, pretty, uh, shorts, whatever you wanna, you know, kind of pair it with. I really, really like this. I also love nudes. Y'all know me, y'all know I love a good nude color. So this works really well for me. Um, so yeah, absolutely love this shirt and would definitely recommend, um, I would definitely purchase this shirt again. So the next item that I'm going to talk about is going to be the skirt that I'm wearing with this, uh, or in the video that I'm wearing with this top. And that is this like seafoam green, um, I think they call these skorts. Um, I honestly wasn't sure about this in the beginning because I feel like I wore a skirt when I was like in fifth grade or maybe like, I don't know when I was like five years old, but I guess skirts are coming back. So you have the shorts in the back and you have the skirt in the front. And honestly, uh, my best friend convinced me to get this. I really wasn't sure. And I was honestly glad that I got it. I absolutely, number one, love the color. I love the length of the skirt. Um, I think that it's just very flattering, um, especially, you know, depending on how you pair it. I, you know, would pair it with, you know, this top or, you know, another top that's very similar. You can do something that's more long sleeve if that's more your vibe. Um, but absolutely love these. Like, I think that this is so cute. Pair it with some heels. I think that this is just a great, like, kind of like go-to outfit um, if you pair it together. Um, go to you know statement piece in your closet. I really like the green. I, I love nudes and I also love pastels So this was right up my alley. The color itself was right up my alley It's the reason why I bought it. So I absolutely love this definitely uh, would recommend this 
Um, let's see, the price of this one is $22.99, so not bad. And they also had this skirt in different colors as well. I can't remember what colors they have, but there are different colors as well. If you're not really feeling the green, or if you are feeling the green and you want to just get another color because you like it so much. Um, yeah, so absolutely love this. The, the material is similar to like, kind of like a business casual, like, Zara has a lot of like business casual stuff going on um, but I thought that this was really cute like obviously like I mean I don't work in an office and I wouldn't wear this to one but that's what the material is kind of like like if you thought of like some business casual slacks um, that's gonna be what this material is like so yes would absolutely recommend this skirt and for the skirt I got this in a size small so the next item that I'm going to feature is going to be this white crop top that I got. So this is just a kind of a basic white crop top. Um, it has like some different drawstrings um, at the kind of like at the, I don't know what you call this, like the under bra area, um, some drawstrings. Um, I'll be honest, not a fan of this top. Um, I don't know what it is. Like for me, I think... I, I'm not really feeling like the scrunched up kind of nature underneath. Um, I also thought that it was going to look a little different on me. Um, and it just, I don't know, it just, it really wasn't, it wasn't really giving much at all. Um, so, so yeah, that's kind of this top. This top was $39.90. Um, definitely going to send this back. Um, you know, just really wasn't a fan. I think that, you know, I'm really in this era and I've talked about this before about, you know, not necessarily just buying anything just to buy it or just having it just to have it. Um, I want to love all of the clothes that I have so I can be excited to wear them all because I think that we all, you know, may have pieces in our closet that we just never wear. They just get skipped over because we're just not excited about them. It's not the place that I'm in. I'm not into, you know, wasting money. So this will definitely be getting sent back. But if it's something that you think that you may want to try if you like kind of how it looks on me or the color or the, you know, the drawstring kind of ruched nature. Definitely go ahead and check it out. It's not that bad when it comes to the price point. Just wasn't right for me. Um, and I got this in a small. So yes, if this is something that you are into, definitely check it out. Don't let me hold you back. These are just my honest opinions. All right, so the next item that I'm actually gonna feature is another item that I really was kind of apprehensive about, but kind of got talked into, and that is this denim top. Um, this denim top is cute. I'll be totally honest. It wasn't really my style at first, or I just, you know, just really wasn't thinking that I was gonna get it. Um, but this actually turned out to be a really, really nice piece. So one thing about this top is that you can wear it different ways. You can either button it all the way down. It's obviously a crop top and you can button it all the way down if you want, or you can button it up into a point, kind of like how I'm showing it here. Um, or if you know you are feeling how you feeling and you want to maybe just do the first button or just the second button, listen, that's why there are buttons there so that you can choose what works for you. Um, but I really, really like like this top I again not really was thinking that I was gonna like it but paired with the right jeans or paired with the right you know however you want to wear it I think that this is a really nice option it's just different you know I think about a lot of the tops that I have and similar material similar design and so I like the fact that this was something different um, you can wear you know I think that this would also be really interesting with a different you know bottom uh, maybe a white pant or something like that just something you know different um, so really really like this um, I got this in a size small um, and this was $39.90 so yeah would definitely recommend this top I would buy this again all right, so the next item that I have for you guys is going to be this, I don't even know what you call this. Um, it's a, a tan top um, and it's really very interesting to be honest. Um, so it's gonna be this tan kind of long top. I really bought this because it has a lot going on and I was really struck by that. Um, so I, what I, I'll tell you what I do like and then I'll tell you what I don't like. So I really like where they were going with this top. Um, I like how it pairs with jeans. Um, I could picture this with like, you know, my Bottega sandals, my nude sandals with a nice bag. Um, I really like, like, I like the design. I like the asymmetrical style. I think it's, I think all that's great. I had a very hard time, much like the pants, 
I had a very hard time getting into this top. So I got this top in a small, I believe. Yeah, I got this top in a small, which is my size. Um, but I think honestly, if I were to buy this again, I would probably buy a medium because it is very tight in the chest area. Now, depending on how you think that may be a good thing, but not necessarily when you can't get the top on. Um, and I just think that it was the way it was fitting me, it was a little too small. So I'm still thinking about what I'm going to do with this one. If I'm going to keep, if I'm going to send it back or if I'm going to try to exchange it for a medium, not really sure yet. Um, but yeah, the getting into it was very, very difficult. There's a zipper on the side and that's like supposed to make it easier, but really you're getting your whole top area, your arms and everything through this, which is very difficult to do. Um, so that was the main thing that I did not like about it. Once I got it on, I think, you know, again, I like the look of it, but it just, for me, was not very functional, The what I had to do to actually get in it and get out of it. Um, and then I really like the neck part that kind of goes around. But what I will say is that, you know, this is pretty tight on you. It has to be pretty tight in order for this to stay up. And then the back... You just kind of have like this just like hanging in the back and it was just kind of weird so what i did was i just took it and i just kind of wrapped it around the back of my neck area to just kind of like make sure that it wasn't just like flopping everywhere so could have done a little bit better on the design i'm not gonna lie and also could have made this a lot easier to get into um it would have been nice if this entire you know section just or the entire side you know completely opened that would have made it a little bit easier but again whatever um so yeah i'm not sure what i'm gonna do about this is kind of <laughs> my the end of my rant i'm really not sure but love the look love the style love what they were going for but the functionality has just got me in a place where i'm just not really sure so yeah let's see so how much was this top so this one was 49.99 or 49 yeah 49.90 so not too bad for you know kind of what i would expect this to be but again still trying to figure out what i'm going to do with this one but yes this will be linked in the description as well all right so the next item that i'm going to feature is actually an item that i bought when i i put it together with actually this top in my mind um and that is going to be these pink pants i mean yeah they're pink to me they're like a salmon color um pants so the material is like a light kind of uh, windbreaker-ish material. How it looks on camera is pretty much how it feels. Um, very light, very airy. So if this is something that you are going to want to purchase for the spring and the summer, it is definitely light enough for you know some of those really hot days. If you are a pant person in those really hot during those really hot days, um, I would definitely recommend this. My only issue with these pants is that there is no zipper or there is there's it's just a like a waistband so in order to get into the pants you have to you know get in them there's nothing that you can open up to make them wider so if you are someone that has hips i would be cautious about purchasing these pants i got okay so this is the thing i got an extra small and i will say that in terms of the length and in terms of like the the wideness of each leg, I would not have wanted them any wider than this, right? Zara has a lot of pants this season that are doing this like wide leg, super long, like obviously I wore heels in the video so that you would really be able to get the full effect because I would never wear these with flats. I mean, you can, but I just wouldn't. Um, just, you know, number one, because of the, the type of pant that they are. And then number two, because of the length, like this would just drag on the ground for me. So I did get this in an extra small. I just realized that. But the reason I got it in an extra small is because I knew that it was going to be big on me. So I probably would have had an easier time getting into the small but that just wouldn't have fit me. So it just would have been too big. So you see what I'm saying? Like, I don't know, the sizing is just kind of weird with this. Um, you know, also they're just making their pants really, you know, wide leg right now. So kind of do what, do with that what you will. Um, I mean, it wasn't terrible getting in these, but like, I don't have like a whole lot of hips. So if those, for those of you who do, you may have a harder time getting into these pants. So that's just kind of one thing. Um, but other than that, I really like these. Um, 
let's see, these were $59.90. So, you know, kind of pricey uh, for the material. Um, but if it's a pant that you know that you think you really like and are really into, I would definitely go ahead and purchase it. So yeah, $59.90 for these kind of windbreaker-ish pants. And then the last item that I got is an item very similar to the skirt that I just showed, and that is going to be this white tweed skirt. Um, I was thinking about something that I could wear to a conference that I have to speak at in the summer, and I just thought that this was really, really that this was a really nice option. Um, obviously, again, we're back with the skirt. I had to be, you know, convinced, but I think it's really, really cute. I think that these skirts are very flattering, um, and they look really good on as well so you know different options for different things um but yes absolutely love this love the tweed zara has a ton of tweed they actually have a jacket a white uh tweed blazer jacket that's also really really nice as well um so yeah this skirt was or is 39.90 and i got this in a size medium and honestly this was fine so i got this skirt in a medium and i got the other skirt the green one in a small and both fit pretty well um i didn't feel like this was too big or too small so yeah kind of do with that what you will as well um but yeah really really like this um just the you know the tweed really love the color you know against my skin i think that it's very very flattering um i would definitely buy this again as well so that's going to go ahead and wrap up our Zara haul today. I hope that you found some items that you are inspired by. Let me know what your favorite is in the comments. I can't wait to read those. Um, we will have more hauls coming for you as well. Spring is ramping up, so I'll be doing more shopping. I haven't really, I don't think I shopped all winter. So I'm really excited to get back out there, see what's out there and see what pieces I'm loving. But I want to hear from you guys. Let me know what you like, what you think you're going to purchase. Like I said, all of the items will be in the description for you so you don't have to worry about that and thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next video bye